Eric going for the Tetris. Had it open for a moment. Is now 14, uh, is now three lines away, two lines away from colors. And there are the colors, everybody. That's it. The game has officially been broken. NTSC version colors at 1,320 lines. Colors have happened. And let's see some of these crazy color combinations. This has happened in PAL Tetris, has never happened in NTSC Tetris. But was once thought, it was thought impossible just a few years ago even to play on the kill screen. And now players are literally playing on it long enough to break the game. Eric here with the 1.1 plus 48. So he's just about to 6 million points. And there's a Tetris for Eric. He's got, so 4.8, and here we are just about to get to 1.3. So 6.1 million points. I'm really embarrassed about me getting the number wrong prematurely. So just try to forget that happened. <laughs> Which means, of course, no one will ever forget that happened. Now, of course, it gets easier and easier to score, you know, quote, easier to score points because the value of lines and Tetrises goes up as the level increases. Eric getting a triple. So basically take the level, add one, and then multiply it by 1,200 points, and that's how much it's worth. I mean, how much is Tetris worth right now? This is just ridiculous. And for those of you who are coming from uh, Mexican Runners stream, there is a... Oh my god, you can't even see the pieces at this point. There is a kind of a debate in the Classic Tetris community about whether or not a line cap is needed or some kind of cap. And people who are in favor of that will point to this kind of thing as an argument for it. And Eric going to top out here with the quadruple rollover. Has rolled over the score four times with 1,408 lines being achieved. 